The rabbits have got themselves an early warning system. The Americans use AWACs, rabbits use roe deer. This wheat field is a favourite grazing spot for both species, big and small. The deer numbers here are up to around 16 animals and they are far better at spotting an air gunner than the rabbits. It's like they're the guardians of rabbit paradise. And what I'm going to have to do is work out a way around them. Now, I've tried lying there prone and hoping that they'll just sort of breeze past me. But as soon as they're within sort of 30 yards, especially if they're upwind of me, they're smelling me, they're away like there's no tomorrow. Some of you keen-eyed viewers may have noticed that Jamie's BSA Scorpion SE is sporting a new look. As you can see, the affair's going very, very well. I've even gone and bought her a couple of gifts, a new dress and some new, new glasses. The reason I changed the stock, or BSA sent me a new stock, is simply because obviously for me, with the whole digity thing, um, it's rather difficult to walk around without having a, a shoulder thing, and I didn't want to ruin the beautiful oak one. Don't know whether it's any better looking, kind of jury stood out on the whole, you know, is it better looking thing, but far more, far more grippy for me, to be honest with you. So it's a bit sort of pragmatism over beauty. I'd love to have the wooden stock on here, but with the sling swivels and the slightly more grippy stock, it means I can obviously get more satisfaction out of using the gun, or at least more accuracy out of it. Jamie makes it safely past the deer. His ruse is working. But is the ting pat of the air gun going to spook both roe and rabbits? The deer don't seem to mind so much. It's the impact of the pellet, which is what I was hoping, which is causing them to dash off and then come back in again. But that, that's absolutely fine. Because if the rabbits see the deer there, they don't see a predator, which is great news for me. In these windy conditions, some of you may not even grab your air gun as the first choice, but they do have their advantages. The guy who comes up here, a uh, great guy, really nice bloke, comes up here with, a, with his powder burners, or whatever you want to call them, fires a load of shots off, and he finds along this ridge difficult simply because as soon as he's had one shot, the rabbits aren't daft, they run for cover, they're not coming back up again, they are really, really twitchy. With, with an air gun and with this wind and with the deer around providing confidence, we're, we're able to actually bag more than someone with a 17 HMR. <laughs> It's certainly been a test for Jamie, but he's saving your breakfast Weetabix one bunny at a time.